What's up? Welcome to Rejuvenator's YouTube channel. We release new videos every Monday and Thursday at 7 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. Make sure you subscribe to our channels for the latest cleaning tutorials weekly. We also have a new series dropping called Restorations by Vic, which will be more in-depth restoration videos. Be sure to follow us on all social media platforms and always shop at rejuvenator.com. What's up guys, on this week's episode of Restoration of Vic, we're going to be showing you guys how to do a proper midsole repaint and a full deep clean on these lighting floors. It's a pretty basic restoration, so let's get to it. Alright, so the first thing we're going to do is tape off the uppers and soles around the midsole before we can get started on removing the paint. You want to take your time taping the shoe. A lousy tape job will most likely give you poor results. Alright, so now that we got the midsoles all prepped, we're going to be using acetone and cotton balls to strip the old paint. Alright, so the paint on these are coming off pretty easy. On other shoes though, you might have to put a little more elbow grease to get the paint off. Alright, so we're ready to give the shoe a proper deep cleaning. We're going to be using a Rejuvenator Sneaker Cleaner and a Rejuvenator Suede Brush. Just a reminder, when cleaning suede, I tend to use very little water and more solution to not saturate the material as much. Alright, so that's it for today's landing fours. I showed you guys how to do a proper midsole strip and a full deep clean on the uppers. We're gonna let these dry overnight and we'll be back tomorrow to finish them off with a full midsole repaint. Alright guys, so we're back after letting these dry overnight. The next step is going over the suede with the brass brush to reset the nap. After that, I'm gonna show you guys how to do a proper midsole repaint on these. Alright guys, so we're pretty much ready to get started on the midsole repaint. We're gonna be using Angela's flat white paint and an angular brush. That's pretty much all you need. Let's get started. When painting a midsole, you want to be doing light coats. Using thick coats can actually affect durability in the long run. A common mistake I see by other people is painting slow trying to be more careful like this. But in my experience, faster and lighter strikes provide better results like this though. Alright, so we're all done with the paint job on these. The next step is going over the midsole with the matte finish. A few quick strikes is all you really need. Alright, so we're gonna let these dry for about 15 minutes, then we'll be back to take off the tape. Alright guys, we're back after letting these dry. The next thing we're gonna do is remove the tape, release them, and we'll be good to go. Alright guys, so that's going to wrap it up for these dining floors. I showed you guys how to do a proper midsole repaint and a full deep paint on the uppers. Check us out every Monday at 7pm for a new episode of Restoration of Vic. If you have any questions or concerns, leave us a comment. And again, thank you guys for watching.